choices are to be made once choices. again. Yeah, and, and, and for me, I'm just so straight. I'm going straight for Yuri, you know? Because I feel like at this point I've committed to Yuri so much that if I were to go to Siori, it would turn her off to me. Uh-huh. And there's nothing that's going to happen with Siori. Like, I've already kind of damaged that relationship. You've, you've decided would... that her vagina's rotten. <clears throat> well, I wouldn't say that. I mean, I would definitely give her the spanks, but... <laughs> I'm committed to one person at one time, you know? You're serial monogamist. Yes. So I'm going with Yuri. <laughs> Alright. Well, I'll probably be m most useful helping out Yuri. Uh-huh. Mamma me. Are you serious? Why would you? Bad Bookie! <laughs> Bad Bookie. I can only tell you about to say something to me. No. I was just saying. Ugh. So you'll be helping your head drop like it? Yeah. Yeah, just fucking <laughs> chill out, lady. <laughs> that's that's what I'm gonna do. All of you put the guns down. I'm glad. I have a bad habit of overthinking these sorts of things. So I think your assistance will be very useful. <laughs> bad, 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 bad. That's okay. Will you be able to handle Becky by yourself? Game Grumps definitely can't <coughs> not do this, that's for sure. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I already said I'd be fine. Okay! Okay! Everyone can tell that Nasik Nats... 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 Satsy Boopins... Satsy Boopins. ...is feeling a little sour. Everyone can tell Monica's had her coffee this morning. Yes, she has. So is that, uh, everything we needed to go over? <laughs> that should be about it! That's gonna make this whole playthrough. <laughs> it's just Monica's voice. Are you guys excited? <laughs> well, excited might not be the right word. But I suppose I'm looking forward to it a little bit. Are you gonna take that shit? Yeah. I'm gonna take that shit. <laughs> okay. Do you do the best baby baby? The best Me? <laughs> <laughs> I, I guess you could say I'm interested to see how it'll turn out. That's good enough for me! <laughs> but about dumb Natsuki! Uh. Natsuki. What? Why is everyone yelling at me? I didn't do anything even. N no. That's not what I meant at all. Back off. Uh. Yuri anxiously glances between everyone in the, in the room. I'm sorry for this. I don't really know why Drum Blanket picked me. And also, your cupcakes are the best cupcakes I ever had. What is happening? They go really well with my tea. And nothing that I do for the event will compare to that, so... So... I get it. I get it! Why don't you come over? I'm kind of <laughs> surprised, though. And we'll all have a threesome. Um... Well... I'm the one acting immature. I already know that. But you're trying to cheer me up all of a sudden. I know. I'm, I'm not very good at it. Right? I'm sorry if I said something bad. Natsuki isn't the only one surprised. Monica couldn't give a shit. She's happier than a pig and a clam. Pig and a clam? <laughs> yeah. Monica and I, and I are the one taken aback by Yuri's words. When, she's already, when she already has trouble with words trying to cheer someone up, must be far out of her comfort zone. But I begin to understand. Yuri was trying to sound like Siori. Huh. Even if it didn't work perfectly, I could tell that she tried to say something Sayori would say at a time like this. Yeah! Because Sayori always helps everyone smile and feel good about themselves. No. I kind of appreciate it. I'm sorry for making a big deal out of nothing. But I'm going to say this. Mm. You better bet that my cupcakes are going to be the best part of the whole event. <laughs> ah, I believe you. <laughs> Thanks, Monica. <laughs> <laughs> I hope to understand everyone doing their best. But with that, there's nothing, nothing, nothing more for today. This is going to get flexed. <laughs> so, I guess it's time for us to head out. Thank God. All right, let's get out of here then. Hurry. 
Why do you think it's gonna get flat? Very <laughs> <laughs> voice from Mike. It's very <laughs> sling blade. <laughs> <laughs> you reckon you make me some biscuits? <laughs> I still have to see it. <laughs> Everyone packs up their things. And biscuits. I start to follow Monica and Natsuki out the door as they chat between each other. Bitch. Whore. Um, uh, I turn around. Sorry. I realized that I don't have any way of contacting you this weekend. You don't have a phone? Oh, you're right. I can't believe that slipped my mind. Don't you have Facebook? Should I give you my phone number? I think... That would be the best way. Just give me your address. Yes. <laughs> All right, then. We do the thing. Okay. Then I'll be stopping by your house on Sunday. Uh, Wait a minute. My house? My, yeah, I'm just thinking the same thing. Is, is that a problem? No, not, not at all. Um, I just thought that I would be the one going to your house since I'm the one helping you. Yeah, that's... Uh, I, I suppose that makes sense. Yeah. But if you don't mind, I think I would prefer going to your house. Uh-huh. Uh, right. In that case, uh, it won't be a problem. I decided not to press Yuri for a reason. It's not like I should, that it should matter that much either way, so I'll just, I'll, I'll just need to make sure my room is clean. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I hope I manage to make myself useful in some way. I'm not really as creative as you are. Don't underestimate yourself, Drum Blanket. I think that will make a very productive team. You're just gonna have more weird girl <laughs> dreams. I know, man. I, I, I've had I've had naps, and we played this last night, right? Was it last? No, we didn't play it last night. No. I've slept twice. Uh, or no, no, no. Only just, once from this. Yeah, but my brain has been doing weird things. Yeah. Since we've been playing. <laughs> Even if you only choose me because you feel bad or something. Wait, you don't actually think that, do you? <laughs> I don't know. It's difficult to come up with any other reason you may have chosen me. What a fucking... Get over yourself. You're forgetting the re one reason with the most common sense. I chose to help you because that's what I want to do. Bullshit. No, oh, everyone's Bye. lying. <laughs> Yuri thinks to herself an extremely in, uh, tense expression. Yuri, you're overthinking this. You wanted me to point out when you're overthinking, right? I don't remember saying that. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't realize. I'm telling you, I want to. That's all there is to it. This is getting hot. Do you believe me? I. Yuri thinks really hard again. Really hard. She looks straight into my eyes for a long while. I believe you. As if it took her tremendous effort, Yuri finally says that and relaxes her expression. And I'm really looking forward to Sunday. And she spreads her lips. Mm, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I am too. <laughs> He's spreading his lips too. After that exchange, I make my way out the door and Yuri follows. I can't believe this. Yuri's gonna be coming to my house on Sunday? My anxiety shoots through the roof. Even though I've gotten plenty used, pretty used to handling her at this point, there's no telling what might end up happening when we're outside of school. Uh-oh. More than that, she told me she was looking forward to it. Uh-oh. Is this the chance I have to make something happen between us? Or is it too early for that? Only time will tell. But until then... I won't be able to take my mind off it. I seriously can't wait. Seriously. Seriously. It's already Sunday. It was Sunday yesterday. Mm -mm -mm. I'm getting increasingly anxious about Yuri's upcoming visit. I keep telling myself there's no reason to be nervous, but it doesn't help much. Yuri is clearly an introvert and also an intimate person in general. There's no doubt that she'll open up a little bit when it's... Just the two of us. Just the two of us. Meanwhile, we've been texting occasionally. Hmm. She was extremely apprehensive at first, but it wasn't long before I was already learning more about her. But putting Yuri aside... Yeah. I haven't heard anything from Sayori since she left club early the other day. Yeah, how about that? 
It's not like we text each other all the time or anything. Or ever. I blocked her. But I've, I've been worried about her in the back of my mind, you know? Between what Siori said and what Monica said. Is it really okay for me to put Siori's feelings aside when she might need me? I decide to visit Siori before Yuri comes over. Hmm. Rather than ask, asking, I simply, t simply tell her, I'm coming over, much like we've done in the past. I don't ask, I just tell her things. Yeah. Once I reach Siori's house, I knock on the door before entering it myself. Again, we used to play so often that we've made it a habit of simply entering each other's houses like we're family. And we'll continue next time. Aww. Mm-hmm. What a place to end. I know. What Nothing. a what a what what a place to end. I'm such an asshole. <laughs>